Thank you for taking a few minutes to become familiar with the ATB 7300 Avionics Test Bench from Aeroflex Test Solutions. The ATB 7300 is a comprehensive NAVCOM signal generator with optional analyzer. The generator is a fully functional lab standard signal generator for ILS, VOR, marker beacon, ADF, and VHF COM with cell call. The optional analyzer is a 3 GHz spectrum analyzer with custom avionics analysis tools, including VHF COM, DME analyzer, and optional ELT analyzer. Let's look at the intuitive controls for the ATB7300. Touching the gray launch bar at the top of the screen will display the launch menu selections. The launch menu selections are Exit, Generator 1, Analyzer 1, Tools, and Help. If you touch the Tools selection, there are three sub-selections, GPIB Configuration, Generator 0 Cal, and Resource Temperatures. The generator should be zero calibrated before each operation. To perform the zero cal, press the generator zero cal button. Now let's look at the generator functions. The menu options available are ADF1, ILS LOC1, ILS GS1, MKR1, VHF1, VOR1. Note that future expansion may allow for more than one generator. Menu options will then be displayed as ADF2, ILS LOC2, MKR2, etc. Since the various generator screens are similar in layout and function, we will discuss the VHF1 controls. Touch the VHF1 button to operate the VHF generator controls. Like all ATB7300 generator screens, the controls are divided into sections. Generator settings, generator control, port control, mode control, mode settings. The controls are touch activated and intuitive in design. Let's explore the generator settings. By touching the frequency field, a keypad will pop up. The desired generator frequency may be keyed in. Let's enter a generator frequency of 118 MHz. Likewise, the RF level may be selected. Let's select an RF level of minus 50 dBm. The port control section allows the user to select the output port on the ATB7300. The selections are Gen Port and TR Port. The mode control allows the user to select the generator COM mode. The AM only settings allow selection of three modulation tones and modulation percentages. The FM only settings allow selection of the FM rate and FM deviation. The single file settings allow selection of a single play file and play mode selections of single, user selected loop count, and continuous play. Playlist selections allow selection of multiple play files to build a scenario. Play modes are the same as for single file. Cell cal or selective calling settings allow selection of cell cal tones and codes. Finally, the generator control will turn on or off the RF output. At the bottom of the VHF Gen 1 control screen are a blue dot and a red X dot. The blue dot will expand the control to full screen or reduce it from full screen. The red X dot will close the control screen. Stepping through the other generator selections, will show that the controls are customized for specific use, but the layout and function of the controls remain similar.
Let's set up a VHF signal to loop back to the analyzer to discuss the analyzer controls. The selections we made before are still in place. Let's add some modulation by turning on the 2000 Hz at 30%. Ensure the port control is on Gen Port and turn on the generator control. Let's now drag the VHF Gen 1 screen out of the way. The ATB7300 analyzer option is a full function signal analyzer. The analyzer options are DME analyzer, VHF analyzer, ELT analyzer installed as option ATES ELT. Since we have a VHF COM signal being produced by the generator, we will discuss the VHF analyzer first. Across the top of the VHF ANA1 screen are the following analyzer functions. ACP, adjacent channel power, measures the way a channel of interest distributes power across its bandwidth and its two adjacent channels. Spectrum, Spectrum Analyzer, provides a graphical display and measurement of peak power levels across the frequency domain. Analog, Analog Measurements, is a control tailored primarily for measuring the quality of a single modulated signal. It measures SINAD, signal to noise and distortion ratio, audio distortion, percent of modulation, and tone frequency. Power versus time displays the digitized waveform of a VDL signal as captured power levels across the time domain. IQ trace for a VDL signal displays a stream of IQ points. Eye diagram, digital data signals are repetitively sampled and represented it in the vertical axis. Constellation provides a convenient way to represent various digital phase shift keying schemes. The derived data variables of the sampled signal are displayed as a collection of points. Symbol table provides visualization of actual decoded VDL data packets. To familiarize ourselves with the controls, we will discuss the Spectrum screen. Let's select Spectrum. The signal we are providing to the analyzer is a simple VHF frequency, modulated by a single tone. Our frequency is 118 MHz at minus 50 dBm. To set up the Spectrum analyzer for this signal, touch Inputs. Select Frequency and set it to 118 MHz. Select RF input level and set it to minus 40 dBm. Select plot reference level and set it to minus 40 dBm. Close the input settings screen by touching the red circle. Select the antenna port in the port control section. To start the sweep, touch the continuous button in the arm section. To use the marker functions, touch the stop, then single button in the arm section. Touch peak find and observe the measurements. Touch next peak and observe the measurements. Touch continuous in the arm section again. Note that the signal is jumping a bit. This is caused by a 2000 Hz modulation signal we have applied to the RF output. To measure this modulation, touch the analog tab at the top of the VHF ANA1 screen. Note the measurements. All analyzer screens have the same intuitive type controls and function in a similar manner. A more comprehensive discussion of all the ATB7300 functions can be found in the operator's manual available online at www.aeroflex.com.
Thanks again for taking a few moments to learn about the ATD 7300. I hope you've found this introduction to be useful. If you have any questions or should you require additional information on the ATB 7300, feel free to visit us on the web at www.aeroflex.com. You can also call our customer help desk at 800-835-2350.